Hey, what is going on guys? It is easy. Um, a tutorial here on how to set up your RGH from the bare bones stage. Okay, this is going to be how to set it up from the bare bones stage. Putting on XEX menu, freestyle dash, XM360, and dash launch. So let's go over the requirements and what you may need. Uh, or actually what you will need with your RGH and some accessories. So what you will need is you will need a hard drive 60 gigabytes and up. Uh, you can do a 20 gig but you may run into some uh, storage issues and you will also need a 4 gigabyte flash drive and up and then you will also need an internet connection and as well as an RGH. So we will first start off with formatting your flash drive and the reason for this is so that we can connect it to Horizon and that we can put XCX menu onto it. So what you will need to do is you will need to go to your uh, settings, system, storage, USB storage, click Y, click format, click yes, and then wait. After you have done that, what you will need to do is go to Horizon. The website will be in the description. You will click free download. You will, uh, I guess, add and continue. Skip. There we go. So skip. <laughs> Sorry about that. So basically skip the add extension. Click yes, uh, go through the installation as we can see here, click accept, decline any search offers, you will then click finish, you will then click close, and then the application will open up. So after you have installed Horizon, what you will need to do is install XEX menu, you will first need to download this. Uh, the link will be provided in the description. And what you'll need to do is you will need to extract the uh, file <clears throat> and you will need to take out this code 9999 file. And all you will need to do is simply drag it. Uh, you will need to first, let me just pull up demos here and then drag it. My apologies, uh, forgot one step. You will need to open up the folder, click the 000800, and then you'll see this uh, code 9 uh, with a bunch of other letters. You'll take this and you'll simply drag it. So for some reason that was not working for me, so what I just decided to do was click inject file, inject the new file, and then find the uh, directory for the uh, XCX menu file uh, and I'll show you what I did after this. So let me just go over here what I did. Um, it was not uh, being able to uh, get dragged in so I just uh, clicked inject a new file, go to your desktop, um, go to the file and then uh, click on it and then click open and it should be all good. So what we will now do is we will simply download the RGH files, which you will need. So what you guys can do is copy the link in the uh, description, and then you can simply go to whatever browser you will use, and you can type in the link, or copy it, or open it, and then it will take you here to the AdFly, um, which you can simply just skip the link. Or, or skip the advertisement, skip ad, and then you will um, be redirected. And let's just see here, we're going to click this link, I guess. And then it will automatically download for you, uh, which I have already downloaded it, so I will just block it. And then I'll get to the uh, transferring of the files. So after you have finished uh, downloading it, what you will uh, need is uh, WinRAR. This is a free program. Um, you shouldn't really have any problems with it and such. Now it's going to come here with a couple other files with it. Um, and that's only because that, that's I guess what 
when Rover does. So you'll just drag it to your uh, desktop and then you'll open up here your uh, folder or whatever. Um, and then you'll open up your flash uh, drive and then what I do, okay, so it looks like all those files were gone. So what I just do is you can either drag all of this into your uh, flash drive or what I like to do is simply just drag the entire folder and this is a pretty slow uh, flash drive so it's going to take a little bit. I'll pause the video and then I'll come right back. So what you guys will need to do next is simply go to your RGH and plug in your flash uh, drive that you would put XCX menu onto and all you'll need to do is it's really simple you can either put it onto your memory unit if you have a 4 gig memory unit or you can put it onto your uh, flash drive now I, I like to put it onto my memory unit so if my hard drive ever corrupts um, it's not gonna you know mess anything up so you will need a profile you guys can create one I usually just you know play your one just click done it'll create the profile you'll sign in don't worry you won't connect to Xbox Live or anything just click here character click done and then you can then copy it over put it to your memory unit um, I already have XCX menu and for this uh, video I'll just simply click yes and then I'll come back to you after that is done so after that is done we will then transfer the RGH files to the RGH by this you'll just need to go to games XCX menu and then you'll need to wait not too long for it to open up you'll click RB and then make sure your hard drive is appeared now what I like to simply do is copy them one by one so to navigate through XCX menu RB is to transfer through game discovery configuration USB if you click Y on your controller you'll get copy cut paste delete and create and then your uh, joysticks um, will move up and down you'll use the uh, left joystick to move it so what we'll need to do is click A on RGH files click Y scroll up to copy and then click X X is to switch the directory we'll go to hard drive we will click Y and we will paste and we will do this for almost every single uh, file now what you could do is you could just copy the whole folder over uh, but I'm not going to do that I'm going to copy it all one by one and I will do that uh, just quick here we'll get that going on and I'll just uh, simply talk to you I guess probably the biggest file that will uh, be there is freestyle dash that right there is a 202 megabyte file the rest are pretty uh, pretty pretty normal and then here you have NAND flasher this works for Corona's and Trinity's um, so I provided that for you guys and then XM360 is basically to unlock all the DLC's um, and then we will put JRPC on there and then we will put um, uh, we don't need RPC we will need XBDM we will put that on there and then we will put XRPC and then just to finish it up we will put Ninja on there now this right here is not their updated XCX but that does not uh, really mean anything so that's it so after that is all said and done, you may be asking, well, what next? Well, what I would prefer you guys to do is to set up your plugins. And to do this, you will go to the Dash Launch folder. You will click A on Installer and then A on the default.xcx. Now, after that is, you will go to Plugins. You will then go to Plugin 1, Hard Drive and then your first plugin needs to be XBDM 
Your second plugin needs to be Ninja, which I will not do because um, it's probably the outdated XCX. So then what I like to put here is JRPC for the third and then XRPC for the third or the fourth and then that is it. To save it you'll click LB, LB, X, A, X, A and then B. That's it guys. That is how you simply set up your RGH. Um, you have simply put XEX menu onto your RGH. You have also put the required files that you will need onto your RGH. That's it guys. Thank you very much for watching and have yourselves a wonderful day. Peace.